Hello everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. In the today's video, we will see how we can copy data from one S3 bucket to another S3 bucket in different account. So let's start with the video. So I have two AWS accounts. As you can see, one is Codesager and the another one is with the name of Jaspreet. So as you can see, I have created one S3 bucket in the first account with the name of source code saga and I have created another bucket destination code saga in the second AWS account. So in this video, I will copy the data of this source bucket into the destination bucket of another account. So first step to copy the data, first we have to create a user in the source account so search for IAM, click on it. So first we have to create one user. So as you can see, I have no user in my account. So let's add one username S3 admin user. Click on next. In this step, you have to add some permission to this user. Click on the attach policy directly and create one new policy. Click on the JSON. So you can follow this link. I will put this link into the description. So you can copy the policy from here. Just copy the policy content and paste it here. So you have to remove these slashes. And after that you have to uh, replace the source bucket name and the destination bucket name. So let's change this. So I have a source bucket name. source code sagar replace this bucket and after that we have to replace the destination bucket also so I have a destination bucket with the name of destination code sagar destination code sagar click on next click on review and name this permission permissions for copy s3 bucket create policy so in the policies so we have created one policy with the name of permission for copy s3 bucket so you can attach this policy to the user. Refresh this page. So you can select this policy and click on next and create user. So we have created a user. Click on this user and you can see we have attached a policy which we have created. So next we have to give some permission to the destination bucket so the destination bucket can accept data from the source bucket. Go to this link, scroll down and copy this policy. So go to the destination bucket, click on the bucket, click on permissions, scroll down, here is the bucket policy, click on edit and paste the policy here so you have to remove the slashes so you have to replace the destination bucket name here so you can copy the destination bucket name 
and replace this here as well and after that you have to uh, change this ARN user ARN so just go to the first account and copy the user's ARN so you can copy the user ARN from here and replace this replace this also and save the changes so we have added bucket policy so next step we need a access key and secret key for this user so you can go to security credentials and here is the access keys create one access key select the first option command line interface click on next I understand click on next and the description value key ID and create keys so you can copy this access key and paste it here and copy the secret value and paste it here done so we have created access key so next step we have to configure the AWS CLI open the terminal window I already have AWS in my system so if you want to install the AWS CLI so you can go to my channel I have created a video on how you can install AWS CLI in your system so here is the video how to install AWS CLI version 2 in Mac OS so you have to type AWS configure press enter and copy the access key paste it here and copy the secret key and paste it here uh, default reason name none press enter output format press enter so we have uh, configured the AWS CLI clear the console so you can copy this command I will put this command into the description so in this command you have to uh, change the source bucket name and the destination bucket name so just to go to the bucket name this is the source bucket name paste it here and the destination bucket name So I am using the sync command let's upload one file into the source bucket upload this file so now I want to copy this file into the destination bucket so I can use this command AWS S3 sync here is the source bucket path and the destination bucket path press enter so as you can see this has copied one file into the destination bucket so let's go to the destination bucket this is the destination bucket refresh this page so you can see one file is copied so in this way you can copy the data from one s3 bucket to another s3 bucket in different account hope you like this video if you find this content useful 
प्लीज़ सब्सक्राइब टू माई YouTube चैनल फॉर मोर सच वीडियोज़ थैंक्स फॉर वॉचिंग